Hey guys, welcome to 334 Tactical Outdoors. Today I'm out here to make a video on the Sea Lake Design Angle Foot Pedals. Now this is the Angle Foot Pedal comes in three different options. You'll get the Angle Foot Pedal Kit that comes with just the two pedals, where it comes with the stud mount track and the pedals, or you can get it when it comes with the through hole track and the upgraded pedals. I'll link all three down in the description below of how you can purchase it. Now, if you already have an Ascend kayak, a Crescent kayak, a couple of the native kayaks that already have Sea Lake Designs track mount and pedal on it now, the only thing you're needing to buy is the pedal upgrade kit. The Let me bring you up a short video of my Ascend 133X that I have. I'll show you how simple it is to swap your pedals out. Slide that one off. Slide on the new foot brace. It sits at a 45 degree angle. And it's nice and flat with your foot. Like I said, just slide that off. Take the new ones. They slide right on. That's how quickly you can change them out. It's just that simple. So guys, remember, visit SeaLakeDesigns.com. They have everything you need. These things are absolutely amazing. Now, I was sent these pedals for specifically my Ascend 133X and how durable they was. So I've had them now for about a month and a half. And I got to tell you, these things are incredible. Um, it's a night and day difference going from this straight standard foot pedal to these angled um, foot pedals here. This is a night and day difference. Um, it's kind of like having a five pound paddle and going down to a one pound paddle. <laughs> it's a night and day. Uh, you can use a five pound paddle. You can get along with it all day long. But once you upgrade to about a one pound paddle, there's a big night and day difference. You, you can't go back to that five pound paddle, just like me. I can't go back to regular standard foot pedals anymore. Now that I've had these nice angled foot pedals, they're extremely nice. Now I know the first question that's gonna be left in my comments is gonna be how durable is these pedal and track mounts? Well, that's why I'm out here today in my Bonafide SS-127. The Bonafide SS-127 has aluminum tracks on it. Uh, and it already has a somewhat angled foot pedal on it. Well, I'm going to demonstrate exactly how durable these foot pedals and uh, tracks are. I'm going to compare them side by side, and I'm going to show you exactly the same amount of force that I'm putting on each one of them. When I bring you in, you'll see how nice and flat my feet sit on the foot pedals. They are extremely comfortable. Uh, great if you like to be barefoot in your kayak because they are nice and smooth. They have just very easy ridges to keep you from slipping but they are nice and smooth and comfortable um, your feet lay extremely flat on them especially sitting in a high seat so let me take the camera down and bring you in show you a demonstration of the durability and as always guys if you found this video helpful leave me a like if you have any questions about these foot pedals or anything on my page leave me a comment and if you haven't already subscribed to my channel thanks for watching now, I have the Sea Lake Designs track and upgraded pedal on my Bonafide on the left side. This is my Bonafide pedal that comes standard on my SS-127. It has the aluminum track. If you take the Bonafide SS-127 and put your foot on it and apply pressure, as you can see, I'm kind of pulling in the side of the kayak a little bit. I'm putting full pressure against that pedal. On the Sea Lake Designs here, if I put my foot same way on the pedal and I put pressure on it, I'm pulling in the side. As you can see, that pedal is holding up nice and strong. The track mount is holding up nice and strong and I'm putting full pressure against it. So it holds up very, very nice. Bring the camera out and put my feet on both of them. Put stand up pressure on both of them. As you can see, it's not moving that pedal. Same as this side here. I'm putting full pressure out on both pedals. Bouncing both pedals, as you can see. These pedals are super strong. These tracks are very, very nice. 
these pedals set at a very nice 45 degree angle and like i said they're super comfortable as you can see it's flat design here all right guys i just showed you how durable these tracks and pedals actually are so now i'm going to show you how you measure to see if these tracks will work on your kayak so either your kayak has a couple of uh bolts that hold them on um, they have a couple of rivets that hold them on the only thing you're needing to do is go from center of the one bolt or a rivet to the center of the other bolt or rivet you want to the sea lake designs will fit from 14 and an eighth inch to 14 and five eighths of an inch uh, if yours has got the two bolts on them uh, the best way to do it is to go ahead and remove them When you remove your track, you can see you have, I've got my two inserts here. The only thing I want to do is measure from center of this insert to center of this insert, which is exactly 14 and 5 eighths of an inch. Uh, now that's the, the full, from, the, uh, from this bolt to the full extension of the foot brace itself is exactly 14 and 5 eighths. Now, on my bona fide SS 127, the uh, screws for it are only a half an inch, so they're not long enough to go all the way through. So I did have to upgrade them to a one inch screw. And the only thing you do, track mount up, get the back started on it, get the front one started, and go ahead and tighten them down. just like so and you have a full you have the pedal and the track mount installed um, it's that simple if it's just the bolts now if yours is riveted on like I said that's going to take a little bit extra time depending on if you want to remove the rivets and put the bolts or screws in if you're uh, if you've got a kayak like the perception outlaw uh, if it's never had foot braces on it and you want to add them these are very simple to do uh, just line them up, get them nice and level where you want them at. You get a full 11 and a half inches of adjustment on these pedals here. So you get a full 11 and a half inches of adjustment. They're extremely easy to adjust. Like I showed you guys, these things are extremely durable. Sea Lake Designs did a very nice job on making them soft, but also making them durable. Uh, they had a nice angle, so when you're sitting high in your seat, your foot has a nice foot rest on it. It's not, it's not like these straight pedals here uh, that your actual toes is just touching the, the top side. You're getting this nice 45 degree angle foot rest. You can't ask for a better design. Well, guys, that's going to be the end of the video. I appreciate you watching. I uh, hope you enjoyed it. Like I said, if you have any questions, just leave me a comment. Have a good one, guys. Thanks.